one of the best superstars around. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Mumbai, India, weighing in at 232 pounds, King Slater. The feeling, the electric. And his opponent from Bad Street, Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 239 pounds, Amir Garrett. Gentlemen, I think this one's going to turn into a fight in a... Gentlemen, you are looking at a man who is sick of the doubters, sick of being questioned about his potential. And I can't disagree with him. I expect tonight to be a night where he can silence the skeptics and prove to be the future of this company. It will be a tall order, but the confidence he possesses could take him very far. Coming into this fight, his opponent's been boasting a new, more aggressive attitude. We'll have to see if that new approach will produce any dividend. He's burying elbows in the midsection. Across the top rope. Clubbing four. And he goes into the ring. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. on the top rope. Both knees right to the jaw. He's 
starting to struggle here. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. The thing about picking up the pace of it. against the benefits. I don't know if I'd say the battle scars were worth it, Cole, but I will say the one who did it to them isn't the one celebrating right now. Braun 
Strowman such a dangerous superstar is his complete lack of concern for his opponent's well-being. Yeah, it's like Braun doesn't have a conscience, and the brutality of his attacks in the ring reflect that. That's why going up against Braun can produce disastrous results, as he's practically ripped some of his opponents limb from limb. But he'll be facing someone who has been looking for a challenging fight for quite some time now. Hopefully, he'll get it tonight. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. Yeah. In full control here, yeah. face full of turnbuckle. Boom, what a right! Oh, targeting the arm, this has got to hurt. Solely focused on, ooh! Respect right there. I kind of like it. And he retaliates on Strowman. Ridiculous standing shooting star. Devastating kick. Missed timing with that springboard. Tough position to be caught in here. Oh, put that face first. He's absorbed some damage already. Yeah, Braun bringing out that brutality factor. Quick thinking pays off. Energy strike, what a combination. Coming back in the ring. Wrists captured and oh, that was nasty. Off into the pin. And he breaks the count quickly. Showing his determination there with that kick out. Ron got out of there. And down with the suplex. Strowman can smell victory. Oh, absolute destruction from Strowman. Some serious hurt, but somehow he's still in this. I think he managed that kick out on pure instinct alone. And Braun doesn't know what to do with himself. Doesn't know how his hands didn't secure a three count. Neck breaker! Down face first. Uh-oh. He's going for the pin. This could be it. He's on the ropes. The official sees that it wins.
Introducing the challenger from Carson City, Nevada, weighing in at 322 pounds, Hannibal. And introducing the champion from Newark, New Jersey, weighing in at 268 pounds, he is the WWE Champion. the biggest titles in WWE means you're one of the best in the industry. changing things. In order to 
succeed in an Extreme Rules match, you have to be willing to sacrifice your body a bit, guys. Counters, this could be an opportunity. Moved at the right time. And now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Look at this now, draping his opponent over the announce desk. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Can't quite get him there. Oh my gosh. Terminating knee smash. He's got a kendo stick. A weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. into the ring. He's returning fire. Perfect time to attack. His gun is down. Just one step ahead. Kick to the start. He was elusive there. Powerless position to be in 
right now. He's got to know he's in harm's way here. against the benefits. The reward definitely seems greater than the risk right about now, but we'll see how they feel once they get back to the locker room and hit the showers.